Classic car restoration isn't all that easy. That's why car enthusiasts spend thousands of dollars to turn their dream into a gym. A Charlotte-based classic car restorer is getting national attention for appearing on a popular car restoration TV show. Queen City News reporter Brett Baldick is in the studio this morning with a look at the business, the blood, sweat, tears, oil, money, everything that Pain. goes in. A little Pain. bit of everything. Yeah, a little bit of everything. Yeah. Rust, dirt. Uh, well, Street Scenes Automotive in West Charlotte has uh, been there or has roots tracing back to 2004. You'll find three guys who share a special bond over classic cars, and that bond started more than 30 years ago. There is never a slow day at Street Scenes Automotive. Every day is totally different. Uh, the vibe here is really laid back, but edgy. You could say this shop is now on the cutting edge of car restoration. Back in 2004, it was just a mobile detail company. See any swirls in it? Fast forward more than 30 years and entire cars are being restored from top to bottom by three friends who all met in high school. I remember sweeping floors in the, in the shop when I was 11, 12 years old and just wanted to work my way up and to be able to paint one day. Many of these classics need much more than a new coat of paint. A build can take a year or longer and cost thousands of dollars. The customer base is far and wide. We've had people come from Ohio where they put their vehicle on a truck and brought it down to us to people that live a mile from here. Take this 1967 Ford Mustang that was restored for Charlotte Pastor. The car may look familiar as the build was featured on My Dream Car, a nationally televised show that takes old beaten up cars and restores them in secret for families. It's huge for us locally, you know, to be able to put Charlotte on the map and, you know, to reveal, you know, this Mustang at the Panther Stadium. It was huge. I don't think we've actually seen the effect of it yet. The show helped capture the reaction of an incredible transformation. Seeing a car go from dust to distinct is something the guys are used to, but say never gets old. The transformation from when it begins and gets dropped off here or rolls in here from when it leaves is mind blowing. That's the whole reason we all do it. When you're building a car for someone and they finally pick it up and they see it and they go, you know, a white glove inspection over the whole thing and, they, and they're happy and they love it. Now that makes me jealous that I don't have a classic car, but Street Scenes Automotive has been a part of two episodes of My Dream Car. And if you want to catch the show, it airs Mondays at 9 p.m. on Fox Business. Just make sure after you watch, you tune in right over here for the 10 o'clock news. Yeah. But there's also another Charlotte connection. So the show is hosted by Danielle Trotta, whose name may sound familiar because she worked in local television here. Then she worked with our friends at Fox Sports on their NASCAR coverage. And now she gets to host that show. And the cool. best part about it is she's not just the host. She gets her hands dirty and does a lot of stuff with the cars. And it's just a really cool show, uh, just the way they put it together. And it's really cool that they're able to uh, find these three friends to be a part of the show here in Charlotte. I love it. There's That's nothing like the awesome. purr or roar of an old engine there. Mm. How many cars have these guys restored? So they tell me hundreds, thousands, and the best part is I ask them, do you ever just drive around Charlotte and see these cars again? And they say they will see the cars again when they're driving around. They remember some of the builds. Uh, and coming up at 830, obviously no car is the same, especially when we're talking about classic cars. They don't have the manual with them. So uh, we'll talk about what they do to uh, basically we'll dig deeper into how they fix these cars and uh, make them better because it's not an easy task. So mm -hmm. they have mm -hmm. some challenges when they are uh, fixing these old yeah. cars. Once they get under the hood, you're like, oh man, what is this? What is this? Yeah, yeah. what did this, this used to be? I'm yeah, like, exactly. I can jump a battery and that's about, that's about it. Hey, that's a good skill to know. So Something better that's than awesome. nothing. Yeah, Brett, that's thanks. really cool, That's Brett. so cool.